<laughs> today, 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 we are in for a treat. Because uh, you might have had your Nicole Jr., but I had a girlfriend. Today, all the secrets come out. And we all need a friend like Derek, the one that keeps it real, the one that doesn't care and does everything for your best interest. And it doesn't matter how many you know, uncomfortable conversations he has to have to get to the bottom of things. See, ask and you will find all the answers to your questions. We can learn something from this Derek guy over here. Who? Let's get right on into it. It's time for love after lock up, baby. Who? We. It was a mess. Dante and Nicole, you know that they're 10 years apart? No, dumbass. No, no. Eh, eh, eh. I've actually been thinking about you a lot lately. So then she's talking about to the ex, right? And she's in the hair salon. Now, the last, this is where we left off the last time where she was talking to him and, or to her. This is the her. And the auntie walked in and it seems as if he's going to catch her, like talking to him, right? But it's not like that because the girlfriend, uh, the friend, whatever her name is, stops him at the door. Yes, he bought some very expensive dresses because they're in the bags and everything. Um, and... She's like, oh, can I take that to her? Because he, she knows that he will freak out if he hears her talking to one of her exes, right? So this is how it goes down. Can I take it to her? I'll change it <laughs> So she changes into something. Now, these hair salons, I don't know how it goes. I don't know how much time they have. I don't have, know how much space they have. But I do guess that people do go to proms and stuff and change over there in the hair salons after they've got their hair done. I don't know. But they seem to have a lot of time to do all this business and the people at the hair salon, they really do have interesting days because they get to see all this stuff. So she changes into one of the dresses. Damn. Do you like it? Do you like my hair? Yeah, I like your hair. Do you like my hair? My hair is right here. I was <laughs> I like that. <laughs> so now they're going out somewhere. The friend is carrying all these dresses for whatever reason. And they're going to a pub or whatever with all these dresses. Anyway, I think she does put it in the car eventually anyway. But yeah, um, it's just it's just so interesting. when I got locked up. You better get the door. So she was 18 when she got locked up. And so now she's, what, 23. So this is the first time that she's going to be able to go out into a pub, into a club pub situation. I think it's more like a pub. And actually have a drink legally. So she's excited. See, it shows on. I'm going to be looking like a million bucks. With the auntie's money. How are you? He's just a hit. So here comes Derek. Yeah, he's just mad. Supposedly Derek is a hater, is what Dante is saying. Look what I got. Like. He's just mad because look what I got. Let's analyze what it is that you got, shall we now? Okay. What did you get? A lot of headache, possible bankruptcy, possible um homelessness, possible hmm, what else? I don't know. I a lot of things. Headache, um, being duped, um, looking silly on national but now pretty much international television. Yeah, that's what you got. And Derek is absolutely jealous of that. He's very jealous that he could not have the same headache that you're getting. Take it easy on my girl. And Derek yeah. doesn't give a hoot. So Nicole. I love your friend. Y'all don't have nothing to be worried about. This is my first time meeting y'all been together really for three days. So that's true. Y'all been together really for three days. That's very true. Also, um, she says she loves him. That there's there's probably no disputing that you might love him. You might Nicole might actually really love Daonte, you guys. As well as about three other people, all at the same time. And if that's not what Daonte really wants, hey, you know, then then this is not really gonna work out, right? So yeah, I don't know. It's a lot of I gotta be worried about. She mm. talked about him every day about how much she loved him. I don't believe neither one of you. <laughs> Period. You shouldn't believe any of them. Like, they're all in this for... I don't know what the, the Audrey, the friend, is in this for. But, yeah, you can you can all have ulterior motives. She just wants to see her friend, you know, excel at her finessing strate strategies, you know? What are you looking for? Nobody. Well, that is the worst thing you could ever do. What do you mean, nobody? We all saw you frantically looking around. And Derek is like, my guy, are you, are you seeing what I'm, are you, are you seeing what I'm seeing? Hello? Who, who is nobody? My friend might come tonight. Also, this dress with the bra showing, that's not the business. You, this type of dresses, if you're gonna dress like this, it's a no bra or a nipple thing 
or uh, something to cover up the things that you need to cover up but you don't you don't wear like this where your whole entire bra is showing no so y'all better invest in some good bras okay some coverings and things because this ain't it what friend hi i'm sia and also, why is the friend dressed like she's going to the grocery store and then you're dressed like this? Like, they're obviously trying to make her like this hot blonde chick and, and the rest of them are dressed like they're going to the supermarket. I don't, I don't know. know. Although, guys, wear whatever, but yeah. I mean, I've talked about her and seen a few times. Have you slept with her? Yeah, I slept with her. Yeah, I slept with her. Yeah, I slept with her. I'll you you I need to go to the bathroom. I bet you do. Yeah, he got the truth out. He got the truth out just by simply asking. It's not difficult. You want an answer to something, you ask a question. Simple. Dante has never even gone this far. Well, kind of. He said, you haven't uh, done the tantana with anybody. He said, nah. And he said, with anybody. He said, nah, no, nah, not with anybody. But I guess, I guess you need a friend like this to catch you off guard. Yeah, answer that damn question. He slept with her like one time. Well, I can't even touch the mother. <laughs> <laughs> They're laughing at you, Dante, because for people who are in this lifestyle, who don't care about um, waiting before marriage and all the rest of this stuff, right? And you're spending all these tens of thousands of dollars, and this woman doesn't want to be affectionate towards you. Yes, your friends will laugh at you. They will laugh at you because. You're spending all this this money. Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. You're spending all this money and you, you haven't secured the deal. Is this woman going to marry you? You don't know. Is this forever? You don't know. But you're spending your whole life savings on this woman. So yeah, you look kind of crazy. While in prison, they weren't allowed to uh, touch other people. That's what she told him, but it's a lie. I mean, we know from shows, from everything, that stuff goes down in prison. We don't know how, but somebody have time or make time and find places to hide to do these things. So yeah, you shouldn't have believed that anyway. It makes me uncomfortable. To do the tantantana with him. That one is uncomfortable. But everything else that she was doing in prison where people can catch you, that was not uncomfortable. But you ain't uncomfortable with me spending my money on you. I like that at least he's confronting her. Still would have been with you even if you didn't spend all that money on me. I would stay with you lies i would stay with you even if you sp didn't spend that money on me bet from now on you're on your own you're on your own i'm not spending a single dime everything that he's already spent is a lot from now on don't spend anything and see if the affection is real see if she really loves you if she really wants to spend time with you i'm not even talking about the tantantana spend time these guys don't even know each other's favorite colors like she said the last time so let's get that in order you know but once we get there we'll see how i feel and we will decide if we will sleep in separate rooms or in the same room because she's gonna go with him and then decide what she's going to do and he's okay with that that's all i was for nice meeting you he just wants to be with her he just wants to be in the same environment with her get to know her better you know it's not really only about the tantantan just to be together but she keeps dazzling to the mom's place and yes i guess somebody asked in the comments as well where is she paroled to to the auntie's house or to her mom's house? Because it's becoming confusing. Derek, well, I hope next time we can be on a, on a more mature level. You'll be gone in two months. It's okay. Oh. Yes. This is the... Yes. I like the honesty. I like the rawness. It's like, you'll be gone in two months. It's okay. Like... Three years, I'll still be here. I love you. Give her a chance. No, dumbass. No. No. Eh, eh, eh. Oh. I don't want to go that far. Listen to what she's saying. Just just listen to what she's saying. Okay. In three years, I'll still be here. Okay. My love I'm watching. You. Give her a chance. No, dumbass. No, no. Eh, eh, eh. Oh. I'm saying, I don't want to go that far. Most. She's laughing with it, but it's what people don't take very seriously. She's saying she doesn't want it to go too far. She's giggling. But she means that, okay? So if you force and force and force and it goes too far, now you've got a case on your hand. Like, for real, a case on your hand, okay? Um, when a woman's like this and has repeatedly said it's uncomfortable and this and that, don't, don't even... 
just just sit next to each other okay they're getting to know each other which is what you're kind of alluding to that that's very important for you just being together even if you're not in the same room yada 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 you're like okay i'm cool with that don't then go home and the first thing you do is hey come over here put your legs over here don't do all that because the woman already said that she doesn't want that let her take the initiative let her be comfortable this is one thing that people need to know and need to note that even though and there's been drinks involved so her reflexes are not going to be as sharp um her her speaking her her vocabulary is not going to be as vast um but one no is all you need okay in three years i'll still be here my loves you give her a chance no dumb man no no eh, eh, eh. Oh. okay i don't want i just i don't want to go i don't want to go that far most women i know you've been away from a man for four years you're going to run to it when you get out. A little frustrating. You can at least sit on my face. Come on, do something. Oh, my God. Oh, man, I'm hungry. This guy is too much. Like, he's too much. She does not want that. <laughs> hungry. I bet you are hungry. <laughs> he said he's hungry. Hey, you better get you some spiritual food. You better talk to Jesus because you need up him up in this thing. This is messed up. This is, like, so toxic. This is... This is not a relationship. I don't know what this is. But I think we should wait. All right, babe. You know what I mean? I respect it, yeah. You gotta respect it. Good. Good on you, Dante. You gotta respect it. Yeah, you do. I'm not just gonna jump into it. But then... I'm gonna try. She does all that. That's another thing, ladies. Don't do that. I'm not just gonna jump into it and then do everything that makes it seem like you're you're ready to jump into it. If you're not ready to jump into it, go change into big grandma pajamas or whatever. Sit somewhere else or sit next to him, but not that close. Don't sit like like this. And don't give up mixed sing signals. You know, obviously he went and bought that specific dress because he wants to see all this stuff going on. But yeah, you've gone out. You're now in the house. Don't use that same dress that's very revealing and everything to sit to sit like in this manner. What do you want him to do? You know? You're asking for all this self-control, and yet you keep, you keep poking. You know what is that? I don't know, but I love that he respected it. He heard her no, which is amazing. It's Dante. I think he's a very, very good-looking man. He's a little scrawny, but he's got his little muscles and everything. To be honest, his little muscles, it um takes a lot to look like how Dante looks. Like to be that lean, he's got like the six-pack and everything. To be that lean, your diet needs to be on point and exercises and stuff as well too so yeah not doing bad on that front but would you look at her tattoo loyalty eh? people with these type of tattoos you gotta be a little bit weary because is it there to prove a point to other people because they rather would think that you are not the loyal type or is it also to just remind yourself oh yeah loyalty anytime you're in the mirror oh yeah oh yeah loyalty okay yeah yeah gotta, gotta stay loyal um he has really pretty eyes and teeth She's like, this is literally physical things, right? She's not talking about his character or anything. He's got really pretty eyes and teeth. I guess that's why I'm with him. I, I don't know. I'm all. He's all dizzy and everything. Fired up and ready to go. Ready to go and got shut down. All else. Because you guys don't communicate. Well, would you look at that? If it ain't Nicole Jr. still hiding under the bed. I, think need I don't know how they got him. To reveal that he has this Nicole Jr. Like how they got him to make this thing part of their storyline. But it is. Go. <laughs> I think I, I need you guys to go. You, gladly. Uh, bye. Bye. I could get used to being with Dante for the rest of my life. But I have been I could get used to getting Dante's money for the rest of my life. That's what she means. Talking to my exes, Zach and Tia. And, and why is this camera here? This camera, this is such a weird angle. Who the heck put that camera up there? Uh, it's weird. You better remove that when you're, you know, getting stuff off and stuff. That's weird. This is too invasive anyway. This reality TV show stuff, it's not for everybody, you guys. Because somebody out there is going to have footage of them being but in their bedroom. If you have a camera up there like this, like, what? Yeah, something about it is... It could happen accidentally. You're just walking into your room and you're like, oh crap, a doodles. Yes, there's cameras everywhere. Fine, so. What did she even say? Let's look at the lie that she was telling right now. I don't believe anything. Like what Derek was saying, I don't I believe anything. I have been talking to my exes, Zach and Tia, 
and something about it is thrilling so something about it is thrilling so it's thrilling till they all discover each other till they all figure out hey you talking to this one hey you talking to that one and it will just take a get together like Derek now knows about Tia so the next time you get together and all of a sudden you have Zach there as a friend or whatever which might not happen but you never know then Derek will start asking the pertinent questions and the truth will be revealed. You can never keep these secrets for too long. We've seen this in several seasons. We've seen this in our own lives. We've seen it in people around us. Lying doesn't get you anywhere. The truth will surely come to light sooner rather than later. So don't lie. Don't put yourself in situations where you need to lie, where you got to lie. It's not worth it. Rambled on enough about this couple. In any case, if you're not already part of the family, make sure you hit bomb, stomp, ass, zone, on that subscribe button. Comment because I really want to know anything. Like, because you obviously like this video and hit the notification bell. Watch it. I'll see you in the next video, which will be tomorrow. Daily ish videos up in here. In the meantime, make time for glorious life. It's time to start what? Living it right. God bless. Mm.